So, uh, what are the root causes of data leak? Um, well, nowadays, um, what we encounter every day and what is actually the most common uh, way of uh, data uh, that uh, that leak is the human error, because um, I think everybody, uh, everybody, uh, each of us can, um, you know, um, can. Um, Imagine a situation when you, for example, send uh, an email and you send, uh, for example, customer database. You want to send uh, send it to your colleague, but the Outlook or uh, an, uh, another client that you are using just offers you to use um, uh, just offers you the first address that uh, comes uh, comes into his mind, and that might be uh, that might be someone else that you didn't want to. Um, Set it to, for example, somebody from the external company, some subcontractor even, and uh, by mistake you don't even know. Um, you just you are just sharing the sensitive customer data with uh, with somebody else, and these are things that actually happen every day uh, throughout the organizations. They might have uh, smaller or bigger impacts, but but uh, from our experience, 80% of uh, data leaks happen uh, for, via human error. And uh, what is related to that is uh, that there are some problems in processes in companies. Uh, the, the important thing is uh, that um, in many cases, uh, the employees that work with sensitive data uh, never, never really know uh, that they are doing something that uh, is uh, risky or shouldn't be done because of the security reasons. For example, sharing the data uh, via public cloud or using unencrypted uh, USB sticks or other external media for sharing the data. So um, why why this uh, uh, why this while this is happening um, by just a problem that you haven't provided to to the to the employees a secure way for transferring or handling the data they don't know it and uh, they they might uh, they might leak the data this way. And the third part is definitely, well, you know, uh, as we all uh, can uh, can imagine, disgruntled employee. But uh, also, there are many cases where, uh, where, for example, employee leaves the company just for, um, you know, finding a company of his own. He doesn't want to invest into uh, into research uh, and development, so he just um, takes all the data with him and uh, and for a better price because he didn't. Uh, didn't need to uh, invest to to the research. He can make the same products that you are doing. So these are uh, also situations that happen quite often. But uh, let's say that what the leaks that we encounter the most are the ones related to human error or the processes that aren't set correctly. So uh, who is the target uh, really? Uh, the target is uh, every company uh, because every company possesses some personal data. Uh, some important know-how, as I already mentioned, uh, for example, design plans for some companies that are uh, that are from heavy industries, engineering, uh, they will definitely have some design plans or source code uh, when, when it comes to software companies. And uh, every company has uh, some financial data of some sort that shouldn't be uh, shouldn't be leaked. And uh, every company definitely uh, has some employees that work with the data every day, and by mistake they can. Uh, they can um, they can introduce an incident to your company. So um, when it comes to sensitive data, uh, these are confidential information which, uh, when leaked, can uh, cause damage to your company. Um, this might be uh, different for uh, companies that work in different fields. For example. Uh, for the companies in healthcare, uh, or well, let, let's start with uh, companies doing some some sort of business or uh, selling selling some things, uh, or uh, cooperating with some subcontractors. The contracts are uh, are definitely sensitive. Then strategic plans. This is ultimately sensitive for a any company, any uh, any uh, any company that uh, has uh, makes some strategic the decisions. That is uh, virtually every company uh, in in there. Uh, and uh, also a know-how, as I already mentioned, whether design plans or source code, custom databases, definitely for companies doing uh, selling some some products, and also personal customer information and uh, industrial drawings. And we can we could continue we could continue uh, for the rest of the day, but um, uh, but I think we can all imagine that uh, that every company has some sensitive data that should be protected.